what is exactly the problem that you're trying to solve? And who is it that you are trying to solve it for? It is a very valid answer that I'm trying to solve this problem for myself. I have this problem and I'm trying to solve it for myself. That is the valid, very absolute valid answer to it. Or it could be that, okay, I'm solving it for a friend of mine. I'm so like me as a Talha, I'm solving it for Essen. So he has a problem and I think I should be helping him to basically lift up his luck in terms of problems. Or it could be the case that if you have colleagues, you have a circle, you already have a network or you see a problem out there in society and then you're trying to solve it over there. Once you understand who is it that you're trying to solve it for, then you need to understand what is it that they need. Is it the case that they need a web app that they would be opening up, going to a particular URL, taking certain steps over there and then selecting a project and then they open up the feedback page over there and then they type in star ratings or whatever else is that what they are what they need in order to provide in order to basically help in solving that problem or they need something else they need a mobile app they need to just scan a qr code reach the page that they are supposed to be reaching and then start their journey in the talk is it that it is going to be after the talk after the session you have done or during the session or pre-session do they need to submit their questions to it so that they can be answered live in the session does it need to be during during the talk itself that they can provide the sentiment of what needs to happen. So yes, there could be scenarios where the talk started very nicely, shared some resources, 